Hey everyone, Damien Ditch here from Needs 2 Minutes Work Once More, bringing you a 2 vs 2 Men of War game with live commentary on the uh, Canyon map. So we're playing as your say, opponents are playing as your society. So it's the second time we're trying to do this, because last game one of the players had to quit, of course, not even lag out, they just straight on quit. It's just ridiculous. Because really, they weren't doing too badly, really. We're only 100 points behind, they were pressuring the hell out of us, our opponents, that is. But, what the hell, they decided to quit anyway, because really, if you're 100 points behind, score points behind, that is, uh, near the beginning of the game, well, there's no way you could possibly recover from that. No way at all. Never mind the fact that you see me recovering from a similar situation in uh, my 1 vs 1 video, which should be uploaded before this one, but, uh, what the hell. That's life for you. Oh, speaking of which, do you have a... Vehicle incoming as well. <laughs> Similar to what we had before, actually. Then again, one of the guys. Ah, damn it. One of the guys um, who was playing against us before is still uh, here. That's the one that didn't quit. So, what the hell? So, where the hell is this vehicle now? Ah, okay, good. Very nice indeed. Taking out just like that, and. Damn it, they managed to take out one guy that was just dandy. Just dandy indeed. Oh well. Oh, what the hell, they're still managing to take the middle point, thank god. What the hell, I just sent a couple of guys up just to. Here we go. Help. Fortify these points, perfect. And we got the middle. <laughs> so tell them to take that. Well, he's certainly earned it, that's for sure. Anyway, let's send these guys up, and yeah, we'll just have to see what our uh, Russian uh, patriots will uh, do in response. Oh, they're all waiting. Oh, damn it. What is the hell? Why is this frame rate... Why did it go down like that? I don't know. Anyway. Got an unstable frame rate sometimes. Anyway, let's uh, just salvage from these guys. Alright. There we go, put them up to the front, and where there's the IKS, because we could just take one of these Thompsons perhaps. Okay, good, he's sending an M5, why not? So yeah, I don't know why the frame rate still is up and down even on a 2 versus 2 game of all things. In a PC, this should be alright. So, yeah, I don't know. In either case, what the hell, I think I might just send a couple of guys maybe, just to. AP mine the right flag while we're at it, really. There we go. Hopefully, should we be able to take him out? Yep, perfect. And, wow, let's start to throw a few grenades at the right, which is just standing. Now, oh, what the hell? I guess I have a few more guys to salvage from and all that. But what the hell, I made a few tweaks to the game, so hopefully we should have a better frame rate overall. Although, it still remains to be seen, I guess. Oh well, see what we can do, I guess. And speaking of which, damn it, where are those grenades coming from? Ah, back there, of course. Ah, damn it. Okay then, looks like the attack's begun. So we're trying to be all stealth with our fancy grenades and all that. Oh good, from another thought one of the players was actually going to lag out or something. Or even quit. Ah, there we go. Perfect. Oh there, thankfully it's not the case. So can we just better mine this flag point before they decide to attack it? Although we could just mine mine the flank itself, but yeah, screw it, this will be a, a bit safer. So screw it, might as well do that. So it's not really going to pay too much attention to them anyway, what since I'm supposed to be focusing on the uh, midpoint, as you can see, it's been under pretty frequent attack. And yeah, what do we have? Ah, okay, T-34, of course. Now let's just stand here. And of course, this guy's going to be standing up just for hell of it. Just as well, I've got him to duck there, or else I think that tank would have killed him. Now oh, there we go, at least I managed to take out through him with a grenade. <laughs> not bad, not bad. Where the hell is he aiming with that tank anyway? I think he's still trying to aim at the middle. I think. Interesting. <clears throat> oh, good luck to, to that, I suppose. Oh, great, of course, got more guys trying to capture this midpoint. Oh, not bad, a bit of a hit and run attack there. 
barely managing to keep the sky alive. <laughs> Not bad indeed. And okay, it's down to thirty-four. Okay, a bit of a rare tank, and uh, yeah, as you can see, that would be the uh, the reason why a nice little uh, demonstration there. As you can see, it's pretty fragile, so it's not too bad. I mean, it's cheaper than regular tanks, and it does fire in a nice little arc and all that, but apart from that, yeah, there's only so much to be uh, said about it. And, oh, damn it, of course, he has to die before he throws the grenade. Oh, well. And, yep, so these guys are still lying. So yeah, should be pretty dandy, hopefully. Just wish these guys were a bit better at shooting SMG soldiers. I swear these Russian guys must have better AI or something as well, sometimes. Oh well. Thankfully, with well-placed grenades, we can still take them out. So again, which what the hell is my ally saying there? Wait, what did he say was rare? Okay, not really too sure. Oh well. Whoa, still shilling the crap out of me. <laughs> Need to think. And yeah, it looks like this point is mined out. Perfect. So what the hell? Probing. Oh, okay, yes, the BT-7 A blowing up. Oh, it's so fragile, I mean. It can only do so much not to blow up. <laughs> but anyway. What's this? Ah, okay, still aiming at the uh, Hellcat there, of course. And of course, but the SMGs are basically tearing mine up. And yeah, it's an interesting component of your society having such effective SMGs, at least in direct combat. But what the hell, I mean. I suppose other factions have got other things to compensate. Oh, speaking of which, what the hell? Ah, oh, okay, so you can repair that BA-11, not that. And yeah, what the hell, we'll just send these guys up. Try to anyway, and damn it, they're not going to be able to even take to take down a single SMG guy. It seems. Ah, oh, there we go. They managed to take down one guy. Yay! What the hell? We just move them up for the time being. It's a bit of a distraction. Oh crap! And there goes the middle as well. And yeah, they are not the best, but eh, what the hell? I guess, guess the job done, I suppose. <laughs> wow, fancy these tank men doing so much. And there we go, wow. A few clumped infantry there to say the least. Let's send up some more though. And yeah, there goes all my AP miners. Oh well. Well, hopefully they're going to think they're AP mines on the left, perhaps. And wow, they're actually going with another BT 7A tank. <laughs> God, I don't think they'd be doing that uh, more than once. I think they would have learnt their lesson the first time. Oh well. And of course now they're trying to shell around me, they probably suspect that there's a tank been hiding or something like that. And funny enough, now we've got this BA, oh damn it, this BA-11 is going to cause a bit of trouble behind their enemy lines, not that. Yeah, there we go, that'll show that guy to mess around my flag like that. Yeah, well, they'll just deploy these guys. Damn it, looks like they have a mortar somewhere as well. Oh, great, looks like they took me out eventually with the mortar too. Oh, well, better send up our two SMGs here then, it seems. Especially now that they're, yep, going to be trying to capture the point, of course. We should get our own mortar up at some point too. Or at the very least, use a light vehicle to take, to take theirs out, perhaps. And there we go, I'm just asking what took out his BA-11. Hopefully it wasn't a, t a uh, rocket man or anything like that. So I'm thinking I might perhaps send over a... Uh, ah, okay. So I might send over my own light vehicle, perhaps. Although, CT form does have a... S ah, okay, it's just a tank trailer, but still. Actually, wait a minute, what was this? Cr ah, okay, never mind, he's got a slug, actually. So yeah, it's pretty nice work by him, indeed. Thinking of sending something myself, but doesn't look like it's necessary. So there you go. Easy. Now it just, just needs to get that uh, mortar, although the mortar's pretty well positioned actually. I might just send up my own vehicle perhaps. For mortar. Uh, there we go. As soon as we get the uh, 
single soldier out, and of course the, uh, whoops, there we go, the rocket from it as well, perfect. Alrighty, let's see how well we'll uh, go going this way. Ah, and of course another water too. Well, what the hell, there's a waypoint over there, just uh, just in case um, this thing actually manages to survive that long. Oh crap, better set up some more SMGs as well for that matter. So yeah, this should be interesting, having done uh We've got two... Ah, oh, okay, two... Water zoomains? What do you mean? Oh, thank god for that. God that damn, that just took me out, um... That goddamn rocket, man. Now, oh, speaking of which, looks like they might have been gearing up to maybe a tank here, although... Damn, I thought... Not bad seeing that in slow motion. Damn it, I should see that coming too. Oh well, just as well that I salvaged the uh, bazooka from this thing, man. Oh well, actually I'm not really sure what we did there, but what the hell, I'm sure it was something particularly nefarious, but what the hell, at least we do have the midpoint for the time being. Wow, they're still using their BT-7, eh? <laughs> I need to think. Damn, it's only being a pain in the ass of the mortar, that's for sure. Oh well. Oh, I should probably just bring these guys up to the middle, actually. There we go, this managed to take out a couple and. Oh, okay, almost survived as well. Damn it, of course, going to be a pain in the ass. Oh well. So, yeah, it's only a bit of a back and forth game, but yeah, we're still holding the middle, so. Should hopefully be alright. Damn, those bloody mortars. Well, it looks like we're going to be firing at him for a bit of time. And, oh, for God's sake. Alright, then Scroll will send up even more SMG guys, than it seems. Especially since they're sending. Okay, regular SMGs. You wouldn't think they'd be able to capture the point so quickly, but there you have it. Oh, and of course, that completely knocks my grenade, of course. Damn it. Oh, there we go, I managed to knock out that infantryman. <laughs> Shot him how it's done. Although, damn it, we've still got some SMGs around here, though. Should be able to take him out with a short range AT grenade, though. Hopefully, it looks like my allies have been trouble making his way through the left. Although, he doesn't seem to be doing too badly, though, given the circumstances. And bam, there goes his infantryman. <laughs> oh my god, that damn water, though. Uh, I'd almost feel inclined to bring up my own artillery or something similar. If I need to take out their damn vehicles. I think they stole my allies' Greyhound as well, which is just dead. Oh, well. oh my god. <laughs> yeah, two mortars seems to be pretty damn effective to say the least. Okay, good. Just as well he had something to counter that. Yes, eh, what the hell. I think I might actually go up with my uh, artillery. Wait, has got artillery. What the hell? He, did, he just killed off the slugger. Ah, oh, damn it. Just as I, was, I thought he was going to be able to hold on to it for a bit of time, but nope, it seems like that's not going to be the case. Oh, that's just standard. Oh, there we go. He's managed to take him out, thank god. Alrighty, let's see if we can take out their damn artillery. Okay, well, I was just told to aim at it. it should hopefully just uh, automatically target and all that. There we go. Oh, crap, and I better go for the middle as well. Ah, oh, there we go. We actually did get the artillery with the first shot even. <laughs> Who to think? Wow, it's amazing how contentious this point was, actually. 
Anyway, is this thing, is it able to aim at it? I'm not entirely sure. It should be able to. Bam. Too bad it's just going to be hitting rocks mostly. Oh, and of course this thing needs to be done. Um, needs to be repaired as well. And, wait a minute, someone actually, oh, actually, what do you know? He is repairing it. <laughs> Need to think. Well then, let's uh, we'll spread these guys out a bit, perhaps. Damn it! And of course, I might just get taken out just like that. It's not entirely sure where they were, and I think that guy is just going to waste a grenade for it. That's just great. And yep, it's going to hit the rocks again, of course. Yep, they got pretty good positions, so there's mortars even against uh, artillery fire. <laughs> Ah, damn, it's just in that kind of course, though. Oh well. Oh well, let's see if we can take this guy out. Wow, he's moving around pretty slowly. Oh well. Anyway, let's see if we can take out uh, this other mortar piece, I suppose. But hey, we'll fire it anyway. Got a. Feeling lucky, but of course that's not going to do much except crumble the rocks a bit, of course. Yes, okay, yeah, it is repaired actually. And don't tell me. Oh, wow, he actually su survived by uh, under his own initiative, who to think. And wow, my ally's actually using rocket artillery of all things. <laughs> Rather interesting thing to use, but what the hell? I think that rocket artillery might have been excessive, given that I really did have my uh, artillery up. But what the hell? Okay, what the hell was that? Just saw some sort of high explosive round on that tank explode, but I'm not entirely sure why. Oh well. No, at the very least, no one's quit this round, unlike the. Uh, Previous rounds that we had. And ah, okay, that's we still got that damn mortar, of course. And I think this artillery, I think I just put it in a worse position than it was in before. I'm pretty sure, oh, maybe not. Actually, no. I don't think we can like, hit anywhere near this. Ah, of course. If we could redeploy it around here, perhaps. Or perhaps even behind here, we might be able to hit it. Or we could try to hit this other out mortar. Hmm. Decisions, the shit, decisions. <laughs> yeah, so far we're seeing, yeah, mostly um, traditional warfare here. Damn it. Yeah, it's mostly just a fight for the middle with no, um, not much. When it comes to flanking maneuvers or anything like that, and yeah, there's a, there is a bit of room for flanking even on this ridiculously uh, tight quarters map, but um, certainly not the easiest thing to do. And of course, yeah, now that I'm seeing my artillery to the left, and I was going to be sending in a light vehicle to try to take out that mortar. Going to be running one hell of a gauntlet there, by looks of it. Although who knows, you might just be able to make it. Okay, maybe not. Oh, what the hell? Oh, better spray these guys out a bit too. There we go, perfect. Yes, so yeah, it's a very interesting game it did. So this thing, here we go, finally got the artillery in position. So who knows, might just be able to aim for this thing. Or at least hit around it somewhere. Damn it. Or maybe not. Oh, what the hell, we'll try one more shot just around here. And I'll bet this hell cap killed my own infantry. Oh, I was just dead. I suppose the artillery mentions all bit, so they yeah, probably didn't really pay for itself. Damn it, screw we must just redeploy the bastard. Ow. That was rather audacious to say the least. Alright, let's we'll just redeploy this thing, we'll be able to get the other uh, mortar instead perhaps. So we'll still have, oh, okay, more tanks and all that incoming. Oh, and it's only hell crashed. So that'll probably repair. 
probably. Yeah. yeah. I suppose it's better than nothing, but still. Let's have a look. Wow, he's firing off more rockets even. <laughs> well, I suppose it's been understandable that the frame will go down from that, but still, come on. Now, uh, <coughs> oh, what the hell, I'm feeling lucky. Let's try to take this bastard out. Nope, not even close. And of course, these guys can't redeploy because the tanks decide to get in the way. Slowly losing glass as well. That's just dead. No screw, try to send up another guy. Alright. Jesus, more rockets. I don't know why he really bothers using up against the tank, given that the rockets had too low of a caliber for it, but anyway. And Damn it, didn't quite get anything there either. Well, it's just that. And there goes the mid again. So, yes, one hell of an attrition based game to say, at least if I ever say one. Back and forth between one single middle point. It's almost like World War II, really, given how close range it all is. Oh well. well anyway, let's just fast forward once again into the breach. Just like that um, Dawn of War map into the breach. Well, oh, speaking of which, better. Get these guys so they're not so clumped up. There we go. Perfect. And what the hell? We'll try aiming at something or other. Oh, interesting. Did manage to take out a few things. Rather surprising, actually. You think they would have had slightly better defenses than that, but anyway. Ah, oh, okay, the mine engine's on fire, great. Ah. Oh well, I suppose it managed to do quite a bit of damage, but still, the problem is they'd suddenly hold crush the stuff. And if they had enough time, then they'd certainly be able to repair the damage that's been done, and of course, yeah, they'd be back out just like that. Oh, what the hell? Got 900 points to their 33. Actually, I probably could have, yeah, probably could have inflicted a bit more damage, but yeah, screw it. We're so busy, busy just trying to defend the middle, and wow, that's bad accuracy to say the least. Now, oh, well. I suppose at the very least we can try to focus these down and stop them from uh, repairing it. Yes, sir. That's right, I forgot about this. I suppose we could just put it here for the time being. Bam. Well, wait a minute, what do we have here? Katusha. Actually, this thing should be just in range of my artillery gun, actually. Perfect. We just have to hope it'll fire on it, no matter where it is. They probably would have moved too much, but what the hell. Oh, and we got it after all. <laughs> oh, that's good. That's good. Well, thank God for the artillery then. It certainly paid for itself there. Uh, good times. Oh, and this damn thing's still operational too. Oh, that's right, that was the original target, in fact. But of course, trying to shoot through rocks is not going to help too much either. Now what? The hell, let's try to get a bit closer. And damn it, frame rate's going down again, although I think that might actually be due to the flame, so it's better than uh, it just being due to, due to nothing, I suppose. <laughs> So yeah, so remember Dash's move using the old Katusha, knowing that they had a that I had an artillery somewhere there. Oh well. Damn it, of course we didn't hit anything. <coughs> oh, let's just stand. And crap. That guy's gonna get taken out, of course. Which is funny, you'd think that's because really single clicking it is supposed to be like an attack move come out. For infantry, but uh, sometimes it doesn't quite work the w at all, or the way that you'd expect. So, of course, then you have to micro your infantry like mad. Uh. 
We will hit it. Nope. Oh well. Well, good game uh, to our opponents. This has been Damon Didovich signing off.